Hey! Oh my goodness, it's so good to see you. <laughs> what do you look so nervous for? Hey, listen, I'm in a good mood, so you're fine. At least for now. <laughs> Come on, let's walk together. So, how was your day? Ah, I see. Oh, me? Ah, uh, you know, the usual. Just patrolling the hallways and stuff. <laughs> Not actually. You know what I mean. I was just walking around. I like to get my steps in, you know? I've been trying out this new routine, and it's been working wonders. I've been feeling so much better about myself. And with that, I've been doing a lot of self-reflecting, you know, looking within. And I realized, maybe I have been teasing you a little bit too hard these past few years. <laughs> I know, that coming from me? Something must be wrong. But no, seriously, I've been thinking about it. I haven't hurt you in any way, right? Because, you know, uh, everything that I do is, you know, I come off as a joke, but if you're not receiving it as one, I'd rather, you know, not do that anymore. Ah, I see. Oh, okay, that's a huge relief. Yeah, I don't know, I was uh, just thinking about stuff and wondering if everything was okay, and yeah. Hmm? I sound nervous. No, no, I'm, I'm fine. Again, it's the self-reflecting, the looking within, and um, I just wanted to make sure everything was okay, between us at least. And I know what you might be thinking, that is extremely out of character for someone like me, but you know, even for, you know, someone like me, they're gonna have their moments where they're gonna think about what they've done and have some regrets, and definitely some worries. Huh? Oh, that's for another conversation. I'm not here to talk about all of my worries. I'm here to talk about, you know, talk about us. Yeah, I was actually wondering if you wanted to hang out with me. Ah, no, it's uh, it's not with the group. It's just, you know, you and I just wanted to, you know, have some alone time and uh, chill out. I know, I know. I'm acting really out of character today. As sociable as I can be, sometimes I just need my one-on-ones kind of good to keep a balance. I love hanging out with the group, but, you know, they're rowdy, they're aggressive, and, you know, they can be a bit of a handful sometimes, and... Huh? Does that include you? No, no, not at all. I'm gonna be very honest, I love everyone in our group, but if I had to choose someone to hang out alone with, it would definitely be you. I don't know, you're just really comfortable to be around. That's really it. <laughs> Listen, I'm not the type to have, you know, favorites, but you're just that type of person. Hanging out alone or in a group setting, you're just the perfect person to be around. <laughs> that was weird of me to say, huh? It's okay. It's the truth. And there's nothing wrong with saying the truth either. Oh yeah, I, I got distracted. So about that hangout, um, do you want me to pick you up after, uh, after hours? Yeah, I, I can do that. Alright, see you then. Sounds like a plan. Alright, see you then. Oh, I almost forgot. I just wanted to say, you better stay hydrated. I found out you almost passed out during gym class. No, no, there are no excuses. I mean, I know sometimes, you know, people forget, but you gotta remember to drink water somehow. And I would rather not your reminder be you being sent to the nurse's office again. So listen, if I get word that this happens again, I will be there during your class and I will force you to drink water every 30 minutes. Do I make myself clear? <laughs> no, but seriously, take care of yourself. Alright? Alright, I'll see you later. I can see that you made it. <laughs> Pardon me, I was just laying in the grass, admiring the sky. Here, come join me. <laughs> Isn't it wonderful tonight? It's just so quiet, 
and beautiful. Hmm? Is everything okay? Yeah, everything's fine. Couldn't be better, in fact. Laying in the sweet grass with my friend, admiring the skies. You know me. This is heaven for me. Hmm. I've been very out of character today, huh? You are very, very observant. Comes with knowing me after so many years, huh? <laughs> I can't hide anything from you, can I? Hmm? Everything's fine, don't worry. It's nothing, uh, nothing bad. It's just, you know, those, those worries I, I talked about earlier today? Well, there's a reason why these worries kind of came up. It wasn't just a one-time thing, it was actually, it was a pretty long process. But essentially, over the years of our friendship, I started to become a little more aware of how I treat you. I know that everything that I do is a joke and you say all the time that you're okay with it, but sometimes I just think to myself, is this really okay to do? As a friend? As a childhood friend, in fact? I know this is my humor, this is how I show my love and appreciation, but... I know, I know. I've been this way my entire life. Everyone who's around me knows this is how I am. And they've accepted me for that. Including you. So... You're right. Why am I feeling this way? Why am I even talking about this? Basically, I'm just worried that I can't get closer to you because of the way I am. <laughs> Look at me, getting all sentimental, all about the jokes, I'm all about the fun, the teasing, but under all of that, I'm just like everyone else. I'm vulnerable. And I'm being vulnerable right now, if, <laughs> if you don't mind. I know this is weird, but I feel like this is the perfect place to just get everything off of my chest. <sighs> you always have the nicest things to say, huh? I appreciate you. But uh, as I was saying, I just, I'm scared. You know, I I know I play pranks, I, I tease you all the time, and, you know, I playfully make fun of you with, you know, respecting your boundaries, of course, but still, I, I make fun of you sometimes, and, you know, there are days where I just wonder, there is going to be the nicest person ever to exist to just come into my friend's life and take them away from me. All because... All because they were nice. I know, I know I am not like intentionally mean, but still, it's just, it scares me. I mean, who would resist a gentle, kind soul? Nobody. It's like a, you know, kind siren's call. You know what I'm trying to say here. So, I'm just. <laughs> I'm just worried. Yeah, you're right. I, I shouldn't be, huh? But I am. And it's because I don't want anyone to take you away from me. I want you to be in my life forever. I know that's unrealistic. I know everyone's going to go someday, but I want you to be there for the days where... I just want you to be there. And I know this is, this is so selfish of me, but I want you to myself. I've spent so much time with you and it's made me realize I can't imagine my life without you. I can't imagine you not being there in some way. Whether we stay as friends or become something a little, a little more. I want you to be there, no matter what. And that is just like my pure, selfish desires. Of course, I'm, I'm not going to stop your happiness. I will never, ever get in the way of it. 
but I just want to let you know the truth. And like I said before, there's nothing wrong with, <laughs> with saying the truth. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm okay. It's just, <laughs> I feel like I put so much on you for no reason. I invited you out here to have fun, not to be, <laughs> you know, <laughs> my therapist. I know you're my childhood friend, but that doesn't mean I should dump everything on you. Ah, man, I feel like an idiot. I feel like I put so much pressure on you for, for no reason. Listen, can you do me one big favor? Just, just one. Please, just forget this conversation even happened. And go about our day, continue watching the stars and being friends. You what? You don't want to be only friends anymore? I hope you understand what you're saying. <laughs> saying words like that. Goodness me. You're cruel. You're cruel. I know I used to tease you all the time, but you can't do this to me. You just can't. Oh, I don't. I don't think you understand how hard been to just think about all of this. I usually know what to do, what to say, how to handle myself. I felt like I knew everything. Oh man, the moment you stepped into my life, I swear, I felt like I knew nothing. I felt like I had to learn so many things because of you. The most important lesson that you taught me is that it's okay to be vulnerable around you. That no matter what I say, you'll always be there. By my side. Just the way I want. Just the way I need. <laughs> oh, man. All of our friends, if they saw me like this, <laughs> they would never let it go. Never. But do you see the impact you have on me? Usually I'm painstakingly aware of just everything around me, but the moment you, you get near me, I swear it's like I don't have any worries. No more, at least. Well, today I, I had one, but... <laughs> Even then, you knew how to handle it. You know, I really... I really appreciate you. I feel like I don't say it enough. I tease you plenty, but... I don't show my appreciation enough for you, so here I am. I'm gonna make up for years of lost time. Thank you. No, no, look at me. Please. Thank you. You have changed my life. You have made me into a better person... You've made my life better. Gave me a reason. Well, another reason. You gave me another person to protect. You! Of course you! You deserve everything good in this world. Do you understand? You're a good person. You're an amazing person, in fact. You've changed so many people, including me. I want to I want to give back if I can. I want to give you the world. I want to give you the love that only you deserve. If that's okay. <sighs> Man. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Kind of just blacked out there. Everything was spilling out of me like it was just nothing. I couldn't hold back anymore, so I didn't. <laughs> We've known each other for so long, yet it feels like I'm still learning so many things about you every single day. And I know, many years down the line, it's going to be the same thing. Yeah, I know a lot about you. But I'm still learning more and more about you. And I'm discovering more things to just appreciate about you. 
Man. Again, I'm... I'm sorry for just dumping all of this on you. No, really. Just let me apologize. I... I just couldn't hold back anymore. And I'm glad that I finally got everything out, but I probably should have done it in a more... You know, like, let you know in a advance that this is going to be talked about kind of way, but... Again, my, my nerves got the best of me. I, I didn't know what to do. But now I do. No, yeah, I, I do. If you will allow it to happen... I want to be there. In your life. I want to be yours. You know what that reminded me of? The things I would say to you when we were kids. I'd say all the time, I'm gonna protect you from the world. I'm gonna give you everything you've ever wanted. And here I am, still wanting the same thing. <laughs> 